what is up i am back today's gonna be a little bit different i got um a package from ebay today that's got some like hand-packed mystery um uh, cards um i bought four sets and i think the way the seller packed it was two in each package so i've got that to open and i also got uh my lucky lion club pin club um package in and if you don't know about lucky lion club they just do a pokemon um base pin so i'm also going to be opening that for some extra fun so let's get into this and i'm gonna hopefully there's not like information inside i'll check it before um well maybe i can just whip it open yeah there we go using the knife would have been no actually it wouldn't have been too terribly excessive let's just don't need to cut myself on camera there we go all right let me open this off just in case i don't i want to make sure i don't show like either of our addresses here we go so they're all old cards is what uh, i was told um uh i think it could go from base set to the neo set and let's start we'll start with this one and then we'll go into this one because this one has a top loader in it and that is very intriguing to me so let's see what we got going in this one and the seller was really really nice um i wrote down uh the name so i could share it with y'all but i'll do that after i open everything i think that'll be a nice little uh thing to do just uh share what's happening and i told them to give me like uh a big variety i was like i'm just getting back into uh collecting and he seemed really nice about it so we've got an execute from uh jungle we've got a base set metapod a base set abra a base set two meowth and these are all in nice condition which is good a kabuto fossil a drowsy from the rocket pack. Oh, I took two there. Let's see. Pokemon Center. I'm not sure what this one's from. Um, maybe base set? I don't know. The corn is kind of dinged on that one. That's alright. These are old cards. Magic card from Team Rocket. I don't think I actually have this card, which is really exciting. And like some of these, I have most of these, um, I think, at my parents' house, but I have to go home and like go through everything. Magmar from base set two. And then Electrode from base set. Very cool. So then I guess that's that's one pack, and then this will be the second. We've got Nidoran, a uh, female from Jungle. Ammonite from Fossil. Zubat from Fossil. Abra from base set. This is fun. I like looking at these old cards and getting that like nostalgia hit. Uh, Charmander from base set. Caterpie from base set. Miracle Berry. Whoa, this is a weird card. I've never seen this before. <clears throat> Excuse my voice. Uh, this Is this one of the Neos? I'm not sure what that, uh, the two white star signs, what the set is, but a lot of my favorite cards that I have are from that set. That's a cool card. I like that. I don't think I've ever seen this card before. Golduck from Fossil. Porygon, I think this is base set. Looks like it. And then, ooh, that's a beautiful Vaporeon from Jungle. Very cool. Very cool there. Alright, um, I'm going to open the Lucky Lion Club pin set, and then I'll open this. And this one I do need the knife for. Let me move these cards out of the way so they are safe. Don't want to accidentally poke a hole in anything. Oh, that came out. A lot easier than I expected, but I know it's going to give me trouble in that corner. There we go. Okay, and then the bottom is weird. The way the these are packed are like really strange, but it, it is nice and secure, which is good. Oop, hopefully I didn't just show shipping info. No, 
Oh, it's mostly just customs declarations. Okay. Either way, I'm just gonna open this up off frame while I do this, and then I'll show I'll show the, the goods um, after. Hope everyone is having a eventful, well, no, uneventful quarantine. Eventful is probably not great in this case. All right, here we go. Let's see what we got. So they always come with like a little bookmark um, that has their information on it. I'll leave it there for just a second if anybody wants to snag that info. It usually comes with a little sticker and then uh, a discount type card. And this one I, I ordered from an old set because I didn't get the card or didn't get the pin, I hadn't signed up early enough, and that pin is, oh no, this is the new one, wait, well, it doesn't matter, so this I think is the new one, I think we just went to Hoenn, so this is the, the pin I got, uh, I believe it was for April, very cool, so yeah, it says, the special badge is given to trainers as a status symbol that they have trained and traveled in the Hoenn region, very cool, um, yeah, we just moved to Holland. Okay, so then the two stickers that came with the other two pins I got is this Gyarados and a little milk tank, strawberry milk bar, candy bar, or I mean, uh, ice cream bar. Yeah, and these are the two that I bought that I didn't uh, get because I hadn't signed up yet. But we have the Super Rod, which is cool, and it's got like this little chain attachment. So it says, you got the super rod. With this amazing fishing rod, you can catch the highest level water Pokemon. Which, obviously, we all want the highest level water Pokemon. And it is a beautiful pin. Absolutely. And then this one is Moo Moo Milk. Which is, I saw this pin and I was like, oh, I have to sign up. Um, I was really bummed that I didn't sign up in time to get this pin. But luckily, um, the Lucky Lion Club, every now and then, I think it's every couple months, does a vault sale where uh, they sell their leftovers um, in like seconds and stuff. So this one says, uh, a delicious milk available from Moo Moo Farm has medicinal properties and can restore 100 HP to Pokemon when consumed. And it is just so cool. And I don't know if it picks up on camera, but this is actually like, there's like a divot in here. So there's like dimensionality to this pin. I love this. I'm so excited that I have this. Wow, <laughs> very cool can't wait to add that to my collection and I think yeah then it's just open and that's like the packaging they do like a little uh what's this stuff called tissue paper all right now on to the finale the final pack um let's open this bad boy up this is very cool I'm very stoked I'm very excited to see what's what's in that top loader there this without showing what's in there because all right and I think it's like if you let's we're gonna do this if you order three you get you're guaranteed a hollow at least and I ordered four because I don't know I wanted to I wanted a nice round number so here we have Charmander from base set Caterpie from base set uh, Pokemon March. This is a cute card. I really love the art on that. It's from that same double white star. Um, pack. Is that one of the Neos? Is that maybe the first Neo? Um, Weedle from base set 2. Sandshrew from base set 2. Psyduck from the Rocket uh, Team Rocket pack. It's a really good quality card too. Uh, Zubat. From the Rocket Pack, Omastar from Fossil, Golbat from Fossil, Item Finder, this looks like it's the rare for that one, very cool, I don't know what, uh, what set this is from, but sick, happy to have anything, 
Ghastly from Basic. This is such a ridiculous looking card. I I definitely have this card and I've always thought it looked weird. Um, Paris from Jungle. So my phone did that fun thing where I stopped recording again. Um, anyway, back to where we were. We've got the Pokedex. We've got Magnemite from the Team Rocket Pack. We've got Slowpoke from the Team Rocket Pack. This is a very cute card. I really like this card. We've got Venonat. Ooh, with creepy hands from base set two. I don't think I've seen this card before. What a creep. Um, Goldeen from base set two. Wartortle from base set. Machoke from base set. And then finally, We've got, there he is, Muck from Fossil. I actually have two of these already, but this one is in a lot better shape than mine. Very cool card. Nice, that hollow Muck. Very cool. This was fun. I liked doing this. I'm definitely gonna, gonna have to thank him uh, for being awesome. Uh, this is his, his, uh, sorry about my handwriting, but that, if it'll focus, that's his eBay store. Feel free to check them out if you want. Um, these packs, they were like, it was like eight fifty for one. And I thought it was a fine deal. I bought, like I said, I bought four. Um, one of them was on discount. Uh. I'd do it again. It was fun. I like, I think I like the idea of these, um, mystery packed, uh, uh, card sets. It's a fun thing to do with your, with your old cards that you're not, you're not interested in anymore. But anyway, that's all for today. Um, thanks for hanging out. See y'all in the next one.